OLED has established itself as the display technology of choice for most home consumers because of its self-emissive qualities. It is capable of true blacks, it is capable of vibrant colors, very thin design, wide viewing angles. But a company called AWOL, A-W-A-L-L, -L, has approached me to say that Actually, micro-LED is the future of display technology and they invited me to Infocom 2025 to see for myself and to try and explain the technology to you guys. Now, some of you may know the company before. It was actually called AWOL Vision, A-W-O-L Vision, who is responsible for some ultra short throw laser projectors on the market. But the president and CEO, Mr. Steven Schulman, has actually seen micro LED displays and believe that this is the future and so they actually made the transition to AWOL, A-W-A-L-L. -L. To be fair, I think this is an ingenious transition. It is certainly a more seamless transition to go from AWOL vision to AWOL than me going from HDTV test to let's say 4K TV test. But let's talk about this massive 162 inch micro LED TV behind me. This is AWOL's largest offering at this moment but it can obviously go larger. What AWOL wants to do is to democratize micro LED technology. They want to really bring the price now. Now, in case you're not already aware, micro LED technology is also self-emissive, like OLED. But unlike OLED, it uses inorganic material. So a micro LED TV is capable of true blacks, it is capable of wide viewing angles, it is capable of really vibrant colors, high brightness, and it is also not going to be prone to burn in unlike the organic compound that OLED is using and that is the key attraction of micro LED technology but so far micro LED technology that has been on offer from most other companies have been extremely expensive we probably are talking about six figures from Samsung from the likes of LG from the likes of Sony in terms of their CLED technology and AWOL is seeking to genuinely push the price down to below six figures. It is still in the region of five figures, but it is certainly more affordable for someone who wants a big screen experience that is going to be bigger than any OLED that you can find, but still can provide the sort of brightness, the sort of colors, the sort of true blacks, infinite contrast that OLED is known for. So in terms of specification, this 162-inch A-wall micro-LED TV will use 6x6 or 36 cabinets, and this is one cabinet here. Each cabinet is made out of 8 micro-LED panels. I'm going to show you something really cool. If I use the suction cup and try and pull out one of the panels, you can see that this is one micro-LED panel. And the coolest thing is that the video is still running on the rest of the panels inside one cabinet despite me pulling out one micro LED panel. Each micro LED panel is made up of 28,800 LED diodes and I will show you a microscope close-up of the individual LEDs. AWOL is not using virtual pixel technology to create a 4K UHD resolution on the 162 inch micro LED. They are actually using true pixels to create this resolution with red, green, and blue LEDs. And at the back of the micro LED panel, you can see that there's a chip there, and also there are nine magnets. These round things here, they are magnets. And these will be aligned to the magnets behind the cabinet itself. AWOL also actually provides you with a magnet adjustment tool where you can go in and individually adjust each magnet, either upwards, downwards, or sideways, so that you can actually align the panel seamlessly to the next panel to make sure that you get a smooth looking image without any gaps in between. And I'm going to try and put the micro LED panel back into this cabinet. And the way to do it is to align the up arrow to the up arrow. Put it here. And there you go. We get a micro LED cabinet that is made out of eight micro LED panels and I'm a newly certified micro LED installer. In terms of raw specifications, it will be capable of 1200 nits. It is capable of more than 90% of BT2020 in terms of the color gamut coverage. It also has a pixel pitch of 0.9 millimeters, 
but AWOL can offer a smaller pixel pitch of 0.7 millimeters that will obviously be more expensive or less expensive 1.2 millimeters pixel pitch. Now the thing to realize about micro LEDs is that the resolution of one cabinet itself is 640 times 360 which means that you will need 6x6 cabinets or 36 cabinets to make up 4K UHD resolution on this one. And the beauty about micro LED technology is also its modularity because you can put several of these cabinets into a 21.9 display such as the one showing the F1 trailer and it looks absolutely beautiful with bright highlights, high contrast, a really cinematic image. And I think that this probably will compete very well in the commercial theatre market. But maybe some of you really rich people with large mansions out there will want this in your private cinema room because these individual cabinets can be seamlessly attached together to build into any aspect ratio, into any size that you want. And these are controlled by a Nova Star processor at the back end and they will have up to 8 HDMI input and you can use these HDMI inputs to provide a multi-view experience as well on the screen. Assuming this is 162 inch in your house, you can actually put, say, a main image here and put all your CCTV cameras to secure your home to prevent people from stealing your micro LED TV because it's so easy to dismantle, isn't it? From the point of view of the resolution itself, I want to explain to you that the key to sharpness is actually getting the highest contrast possible. A high contrast image inherently will increase the perceived sharpness of the picture. Imagine if you have black text on a white paper versus a black text on a grey paper, which one will look sharper? The one on the white paper will look sharper because of the higher contrast. And that is the principle with which I'm going to explain. The distance between one micro LED to the next is actually either 0.9 millimeters or 1.2 millimeters. So unless you're actually standing right in front of it, trying to look at it, you won't actually perceive the resolution loss. For example, we have several sizes of micro LED displays here at the A wall booth, and each of them have different sizes. And only this one is a true 4K UHD resolution. But standing in one position, looking at all of them, you perceive the same resolution because the pixel pitch is the same between all of them. It's until you actually walk up close and no one will hopefully be silly enough to be using this as a computer monitor to be able to see the screen door effect or the individual pixel pitch. And that's why I think the resolution is probably a sort of a red herring when it comes to micro LED display technology. This is the 108 inch micro LED model from AWOL it will be using 4 times 4 or 16 cabinets with a resolution of 2560 times 1440. Again, just outstanding contrast, outstanding colors with truly wide wing angles. Even though the resolution is lower than the 4K UHD one, it's still high enough such that you don't really feel that it is actually sub 4K in terms of the resolution. The price is going to be around 30,000 US dollars. And then we go next to the 81 inch version. And this will use three by three array or nine cabinets. And the cheapest micro LED that AWOL is actually selling is a 75 inch model and they are actually selling the modularity in that if you buy the 75 inch micro LED you can actually later on if you feel compelled to upgrade you can buy three more cabinets and stack it on top and increase it to an 81 inch so it's a truly upgradable TV but from the point of view of the resolution this 81 inch chip on board micro LED TV from AWOL will be full HD resolution 1920 times 1080 and clearly if you do some maths 81 times 2 equals to 162 across there and that's why you can get a 4k UHD resolution there but on an 81 inch model you only get a full HD resolution of 1920 times 1080 because of the modularity of the micro LED cabinets, you can genuinely build it into any aspect ratio, any size you want. This is the 99 inch model, and you can see it's in portrait mode. It's suitable for watching your TikTok videos or your YouTube shots. And you can do multi-view functions as well into three screen of 16.9. And it's just a demonstration of how flexible in terms of the viewing experience that a micro LED TV can bring you. 
what I really like is that you can actually build a cinemascope screen out of these micro LED cabinets. This is displaying the newest F1 trailer starring Brad Pitt. It is a 129 inch version. It has five times four arrays and it will have a resolution of 3200 times 1440. But looking at it, really nice bright highlights, insane contrast. It just gives you that cinematic feel that you don't really get in terms of immersion from a smaller OLED display. And the price of this will be 33,000 US dollars with a resolution of 3200 times 1440. And this 129 inch 319 micro LED model from AWOL will cost 33,300 US dollars, which is expensive. But if you again imagine having to install a high end projector that can deliver sufficient brightness and it still won't be as bright as this micro LED TV, it still won't have the black level of this micro LED TV you have to install an acoustically transparent screen. And this will come with six times 50 watt speakers. You still have to darken the room. We are actually in quite a bright environment here on the Infocom show floor. And this still gives an image that just pops. I think with the anti-glare coating. Oh, one thing I need to mention is that you obviously can see the seams from an angle, especially on displaying black, but generally, especially even on the 162-inch largest micro-LED model from AWOL, sitting straight on, the seams are very invisible. And this is probably due to some edge blending technology done inside the software with the processor from Novastar as well. To sum up, I'm generally impressed by the micro-LED displays on show here by AWOL at Infocom 2025. I genuinely believe in self-emissive technology these micro LED displays have true blacks, have wide viewing angles, have vibrant colors. And you can obviously get that from an OLED TV as well. But the largest OLED TV on the market is going to be 97 inch and that costs a bomb. AWOL believes that micro LED is the future of display technology and they are going all in. They are trying to democratize this technology. They are trying to be the market disruptor, bringing the prices down and you can get a micro LED TV from the company for as low as 8,000 US dollars. AWO is saying that their phone has been ringing off the hook, you know, since they first demoed it uh, at CES and maybe even last year. And I sincerely believe that hopefully this will be a good first step to try and bring micro LED display technology to more people. And if you want to find out more about these AWO micro LED TVs, please click the link in the YouTube description below.